mapping. Now mapping is nothing but a function f and what is this function? This function is going to be a relation kind of a thing between set A and set B such that it connects each and every element of set A. Pay attention, each and every element of set A will be in some or the other way connection to all the elements of B, right? To the unique elements means to the different elements of B. So that will represent the mapping. Mapping is nothing but a function which is going to connect all the elements that is each and every element of one set with the unique elements of the next set. So what is domain, codomain and range here? Set A is going to be connected to set B. So set A is the domain. Set B to which all the connections are to be made. That is set B and range means set of elements of B. All the elements that are going to be paired or you, you can say they are going to be paired or you can say they are going to be in function with the elements of A form the range. Now for this question here I have taken set A, set P and represented them by using the arrow diagram. Now this relation has been written you have to tell me the codomain, domain and range for this. So how will you do this? You can take the values by the arrow diagrams. Now clearly all the values in A or you can say all the elements of A are the domains. So you write 1, 2, 3, 4 in the domain section. Next for writing the codomain. Codomain is actually set of all the values that are present in set B. So you write over here 5, 8, 11, 14, 15 and 16. That's for the codomain. What about the range? Then how is range different from codomain? Range is all the image. Range is as the other name I'll write over here. It is known by the other name called image. Image of all the elements of set A are the, you can say, range. So image of 1 in set B is 5. So we write 5. Image of 2 in set B is 8. Image of 3 in set B is 11. Image of 4 in set B is 14. So that forms the range, right? So that is the difference between range and core domain. Domain are all the values from which you are making the connections or making the function. Codomain is set of all the values to which you are connecting and range is the values in set B to which you have connected. Right? There are some values still left which are not connected. So these will not be considered when you are writing the range. Whereas if you are writing the codomain, all the set of values or all the elements that are present in set B will be considered. Now, Important note, please keep it in mind when you are right, you are doing the mapping and relations that is the conditions for relations to be mapping. Now relations can be mapped only on these conditions. The first condition is that each and every element of set A has unique image in set B. This means that for example there is set A, 2, 3, let's take them some random values A, B, C. And here we have capital A, capital B, capital C, capital D. Now, with the first condition, we mean to say that each element of first one must have a unique image. It can have one image, this can have another image, this can have another image. They cannot have same image. What I mean to say that A cannot have image as A and image as B. Now, the two, two domains cannot have the same image. What exactly I mean to say by this? Right? And the last one is that no element in set A has more than one image. That's true. Right? No element here. A cannot have two images. Right? And similarly, each and every element must have an image. There are the two conditions. You cannot have a mapping done like this. Like here you have the two elements of the first set mapped with the two elements. And you have still one element pending. You cannot do this. According to first one, you have to have the elements of first set mapped with distinct values or unique values. It has to be mapped with some or the other value. There should be different values definitely of set B. And another thing, no two images can belong to the same domain. 
or you can say no two domains can have the same image that is no element in set a must have more than one image more than one image is not possible that is one domain will have only one image so these were the conditions for relations to be mapped